Hello, today we're going to show you how to use Twisted Pair Cat5 cable to transmit video signals. Benefits of using the Cat5 cable is you have four Twisted Pairs in each cable which means you have the potential to transmit four video signals down one Cat5 cable. To do this you will need a pair of balloons for each camera. One balloon to go for the camera to plug into which will plug into here and you'll need a second end at the other end of the Cat5 cable to plug into your switcher or your recorder, your monitor or whatever you're using to view the camera images. On the back usually of the actual transmitters and receivers you'll see usually some kind of marking to say which is positive and which one is negative. All you have to do is it doesn't matter what colours you use as long as on the pair that you're using if blue goes to that terminal on this transmitter and white goes to that terminal then it has to match on the other passive balloon that you actually use. Passive balloons don't have power they're purely video signal and typically if you're camera uses any kind of protocol it will normally pass through a passive balloon an active balloon it won't and that one requires power so what I'm going to do quickly is I'm just going to strip some of this cable back just exposing some of the copper core here and I'm leaving it a little bit long on purpose just so it helps me grip it around the terminals. So as I said earlier I'm going to put the blue onto the left hand terminal and the white onto the right hand terminal and what I'm going to do here is just undo these screws a little bit you'll see on the screws they normally have a little metal plate that if you unscrew it enough there's a little gap that appears just here where you can wrap your cables underneath. So we'll do both of them and then just as we said before we're going to wrap the blue cable around there and we'll tighten that up and then we'll do the white one on this side remembering what I said earlier about keeping the colours the same on both ends of the transmitter and once you've tightened up your terminals what we can do then is we can cut off these long pieces that I left because we don't need them on anymore and then we can do that with the other pairs as well just to make it so we could have up to four cameras so what we can do there now as you can see we've got two balloons on a length of cable these ones can do up to 300 meters there is some that you can do up to 500 meters just check on the specification before you use them and more importantly just remember the actual colors that you actually use make sure that if you have a balloon like these two here that if you have blue on this terminal here on this side then the, this side on the second balloon which is that you record and needs to be the same colour again the balloon on this side needs to match the one on this side what you can find sometimes if you don't is your picture could be a little bit distorted sometimes it doesn't make a difference but most of the time it does so that is basically how to use Cat5 balloons to transmit your video signal down ordinary Cat5 cable. I hope that video is of interest to you. If you've got any questions, send me a message.